Following the case of anti-Semitic graffiti discovered on the side of a school in Bethesda, Maryland. It happened at Walt Whitman High School Saturday, just one day before the start of Hanukkah. Zach Merchant takes us inside a classroom where Jewish students held a workshop to fight against hate. It is a conversation no one hopes is necessary. How do you walk around and feel positive about being Jewish when all this stuff is happening? But here at Adat Shalom Reconstructionist Synagogue, the topic was forced. There was a sign saying Jews are not welcome here. The discovery of those words, Jews not welcome, spray painted on a sign at Walt Whitman High School shook Jewish students and parents across the region. This incident and others like it inspired Gila Franklin Siegel with the Jewish Community Relations Council of Greater Washington to assemble a workshop for Jewish students to help them learn to cope with and combat anti-Semitism. Sarah Sherlander, a Jewish senior at Jackson Reed High School in DC, helped lead it. So this is why I joined or I'm participating as student to student is to educate others so that there is no hate. The class was geared towards seventh and eighth graders, getting ready to soon make the transition to high school. You don't feel comfy or welcome in a school if there's hate speech in front of it that is directed to anybody, but especially directed to you. Another class leader, Rabbi Abby Sharofsky, with the Jewish Community Relations Council, says she's seen an increase in anti-Semitic acts this year. No one should be used to this, and yet there is that feeling of, oh, it's happening again. And it's no longer a sense of surprise, but a sense of what's the severity this time. But despite it all, Franklin Siegel says the Jewish community will not be intimidated. Um, even as there was a sign saying Jews are not welcome here, that we know we are welcome and that we uh, are here to stay. In Bethesda, Zach Merchant, WUSA 9. The Anti-Defamation League tracks reports of anti-Semitism nationwide. It recorded more than 2,700 incidents of anti-Jewish assault, vandalism, or harassment in the year 2021, just last year.